uh, party leaders of their own political parties to run a national institution such as the, uh, the National Assembly. So we want to condemn Speaker Wetamula and to tell him he's the biggest coward in this country. He is afraid of the people. You can see the sort of police deployment that is out there. That is essentially supposed to protect members of parliament from the public. I am not afraid of the members of the public. Why should you, members of parliament be afraid of members of the public? These are the, the, the people who elected us. And to add insult to injury, he is closing a gallery that are essentially supposed, if you read the constitution, parliamentary debate is supposed to be open to the public. And I'm not even speaking as a member of the public. I'm speaking as one of the members of parliament. How can I be denied access to the National Assembly to listen to debate and to execute my role as the returning officer of ODM to make sure that we, all, we have all our votes against this financing? Number two, before I let my colleagues speak, we are extremely proud as leaders in this country, as young leaders, of the young people who have taken to the streets to demonstrate their displeasure at how this government has treated us repeatedly over the years. We told them that if you close your ears to the people, they will slap those ears until they open. And that is what is happening here. So we want to encourage those young people, fear not, this is your country. This is your country, and I hope this movement does not die here. Anybody who is afraid of those young people there has a good reason to be afraid of those people. In fact, this vote should not be taken here where there are police codons. Each of the 290 members of parliament should go back to their constituencies and vote from there so that we know the truth that you are a representative of the people. So I want to encourage them to continue and make sure they access parliament. If there is any help you need, including showing you where the back door to this building is, you will let us know, we will help you, so that you are able to access these characters like Wetambula and tell them that you are their bosses and they are not the bosses of the people of Kenya. I thank you and I want to welcome the Honorable Senator Osochi to say something.